While the Ukrainian army continues to carry out defensive and offensive operations on the front line, the Russians continue to suffer huge losses. However, the Ukrainian army also continues its cross-border operations. Ukrainian Army, unmanned aerial vehicles of the main directorate of intelligence of the Ministry of Defense attacked the Smolensk aviation plant in Russia. It was reported that the operation was successful and the target was successfully hit. It was reported that the intensity of the explosion was great and the sound of explosions in the Smolensk region was heard far away. This attack is not the first attack operation carried out by Ukraine on Russian territory. The Ukrainian Intelligence Directorate carries out such operations in secret. And the operations carried out by the Ukrainian Intelligence Service on Russian territory are most likely to be successful. Ukraine has previously organized and destroyed a large number of factories, ammunition depots and military bases on Russian territory. Finally, the aviation factory in the Smolensk region was added to these. The government is heavily criticized in Russia for failing to prevent the Ukrainian army's operations in Russia. It is curious how the Kremlin will produce a solution against Ukrainian attacks. Do you think the Ukrainian army will continue its operations in Russian territory?